Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl T and you're watching T Cooks with Flav. If it's your first time here, welcome. Welcome to the vibe, welcome to the food, welcome to the fun. Welcome just to a little talk, all right? Not much not going on today. Um, I literally just, I'm leaving Aventura Mall. And I was like, as soon as I get in the car, I'm going to make this video. Um, so when I woke up, I'm going to start driving. But I just want to pause for a second for, to introduce the video. Like up the video, guys. Share. Our, our community is growing. That means you guys are telling your friends about my channel. And I really appreciate it. Um, I wish I could just pull over and talk. But I can't because I have deadlines to meet. And it's already late. But I'm heading to UPS because I bought a vacuum on Amazon and I spent like over 200 and something dollars for the vacuum. And then it just conk out, it's not working. So they're gonna issue me a refund. So I have to go and return the vacuum first. And then my cable boxes from my old cable provider, they want me to return them. So. I've been procrastinating on that and as I clear out all these boxes um, now I'm seeing the little things that need to get done so before they charge me for it I'm like let me just go ahead and do that but anyways I woke up this morning and I was not in I wasn't feeling it I wasn't feeling motivated I wasn't feeling like myself I, I, I just have a kind of lot going on in a sense personally and I feel like it's draining my energy or it was draining my energy and I didn't like how I felt but I know I had to get up and I have things to do I have Brianna's graduation which is this Friday today is Tuesday I have to go do my hair I have an appointment tomorrow I had to take out my braids last night I stayed up until like really late taking out my braids um I have family coming in town because Brenna's dad and his family is coming in town for the graduation. We have a, you know, a couple of things planned to do as a family. So I'm preparing for that. I'm preparing for events. And on top of that, I'm dealing with just like people, you know. And I just kind of felt overwhelmed. I felt like I didn't want to be bothered with today. I just wanted to stay home, but I know I can't of all the obligations that I have and um, I called Marvin on my way here because he went to restaurant depot to get some some stuff that we need for one of our events we have coming up we're traveling also for an event so it's just that we have a lot going on and um, but as I said to him say boy Marvin me not in the mood today like I am not feeling it me just me just out of it and it must like go and push through tea, you know, you got this, whatever. And as I walked in Zara, a lady ran up to me and say, Hi, my name is I me, me, me remember my real name, or remember the name which is that everybody call her. So I became myself Portia. And her reasoning for everybody to call her Portia was actually really funny. Because she said she's a PNP supporter. I thought that was hilarious. So everybody call her Portia, which is totally opposite from her real name which can't yeah, remember the real name but anyway she, she was so excited to see me and I felt her energy I felt your presence and you know like I said I love when I see you guys on the road and they can't run up to me and say tea but my know I won't know all of you until they come and introduce themselves to me even in my face of makeup I'm totally approachable because sometimes I'm zoned out and I can't control my facial expression but I'm totally approachable so she came over and she was just blessing me up and you know congratulating me and everything and that it kind of lift me spirit a little bit and then as i walked over to the kids section now because i'm trying to find an outfit for bryce to wear for his school dance and then there was another lady who was in the line and she saw me and she was like she walked over to me and she said excuse me are you tea cooks with flavor you cook and i said yes and she said oh my god and she was just so happy to see me and automatically from the first from Portia now to her her name is Kerry Kerry just started me feel good automatically the energy where Kerry come to me with 
and how she was just like zoned in and tuned in into what I had going on and you know she was telling me yo I pray for you and all these things and Karen told me I'm praying for me in Azara you know like real prayer like you don't understand what that did for me and I did tell her I said I'm gonna talk about you on my channel and she said Lord Jesus um, but it's just such a blessing you know she she went on to say boy T you don't understand like I pray that you have a corner to go to I pray and when she said it it hit me and I'm like do I have a corner because it's like you know you come out here and you put out this I wouldn't say a front because what I put out is genuinely what I am who I am and I put it out there and I try to inspire sometimes the things I'm just come from my heart I'm just talk about it I'm not writing a script or anything like that I just really come on here and showcase my talent showcase what I have going on and then at the same time leave you guys with a word of motivation as best as I can and shows that you don't understand how much inspiration you are to me and how you help me through things and whatever and I'm just there and I'm listening and I'm like man you wouldn't understand some days I just don't feel like doing it you know there are so many times that I feel discouraged for different reasons and I still come out and I still do it and for someone to stop me and be like yo you are motivating me I look forward to your videos and I pray that you have the strength to keep giving me these videos and I may have to tell her I may say you yeah, made my day like you really did make my day like you just don't understand I had a crappy weekend I mean I worked but just things you know and revelations of people and oh and I was just like kind of want to be over it and then here comes this ray of sunshine Carrie who was just so sweet we ended up shopping together walking around like we know each other for the longest time and she helped me pick out a couple of my pieces that I have that I said I want to bring with me on my trip and also you know events that I have coming up and it was just good and refreshing to just meet a total stranger who can just just pray for you and have you on their prayer list every single night and it's just a it's a reminder to me like girl just keep going no matter what anything all the negative things that's out there that's coming at you one by one just keep going because you you have your crowd and you have your people who you are motivating who you are helping to have a better day without even knowing it and that's my reason to like just keep going and i wasn't sure what my next video was going to be i was not sure i was like oh you know what definitely bring a graduation we're gonna do show you guys and take you guys with me at the graduation and all the other events i have coming so we have a lot we have lots of things coming up that you know i'm gonna be able to vlog about but the last couple of days i've just been like uh all right we vlog next week or whatever but yeah didn't know i was gonna get up and vlog today like i said tell her i said why am i gonna meet up on a day when i look like a hot mess and she's like girl please because my hair is just braided down under this hat i have to go to the beauty supply store Bella Yan, come tired. I have to go to the beauty supply store to um, get some new shampoo and conditioner. I'm going to have a 3:30 appointment tomorrow. Um, I have a 3:30 appointment tomorrow, and I'm going to. Um, I know I'm gonna be there probably all night. the next couple of days coming up it's just busy 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 so i just wanted to come on here and just tell you guys for all of my flave gangs thank you as much as all you guys say i keep you going you keep me going as well just your comments i'm telling you this all the time just your comments your feedback your support she was even saying to me your festival I bought it at Broward and I sent it to New York to my family you don't understand how them something means so much to me and the support of my product I'm a small business I'm just somebody who is trying and last week I got a phone call and somebody was telling me that someone that was very close to me 
that was working with me is bad mouthing my product and telling people don't buy my product and telling people our festival mix too sweet not buy it like sometimes I've learned if you have nothing good for say just don't say it because now you sound like a hater because you were over here promoting my festival promoting my mix so why are you discouraging people from buying my product someone that you know what I mean like I always hear them say don't bite the hand that feed you and sometimes we must just be quiet like if you have somebody not deal no more instead of walk and talk bad about them just just don't just don't say nothing just love it you get what I say but for you to be saying oh don't support her festival mix because she this and she that I am out here I created a product I'm a single mom I'm trying to provide for my kids why on Jesus earth would someone try to walk and tell people don't support her don't support like what did you gain from that like what did you really gain from that and when she tell me say yo my family them love it and i love it and da -da -da -da, and like other people have told me i've gotten other criticism from my product before but i think they were genuine um but for someone who would who would endorse it no it's gonna spread because we don't work together no more you're gonna tell people don't buy her festival mix to me that's that's a low that's so low and that is just not cute at all and i really think that you know people should just let people be let them move on don't try to sabotage my product because you never can you know you never can sabotage my product because i earned my stripes when it comes down to my product and if it's sweet guess what we can't always reduce the sugar if i thought so you get what i'm saying but it's just you know negative lips so when kerry grabbed me this morning and pray for me and people like them they share pray for me against like just let them go on let them go no weapon form against me shall prosper and i always i always 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 remember that whenever things like this come up so kerry thank you thank you for that prayer thank you for just embracing me today Thank you for uplifting my spirit. Thank you for changing my mood. You just do not understand what you did for me today. And I told you I'm gonna make a video. You never know, so but I'm not gonna make it this fast. But I just it was on my heart. Um, my heart is filled with gratitude right now, just because of meeting you and the impact that you made on my life today. Like you just don't understand and for me i don't take these things lightly i tell my clients when they book me i'm gonna take them something that lightly you guys can book anybody else but you choose to book me you chose to book me you chose to pay, pay thousands of dollars or whatever i charge to book me to, to support me to support my dream to support my business to support me so i can provide for my kids and i am grateful for that so when i see somebody trying to come around and trying to bad mouth me or talk negatively of me so people can look at me in a different light which is what that person is also doing trying to make people think that i'm this horrible person all i have to say is when put it this way i work for corporate for, for a lot of years all right my, my last profession i was in there for 10 years and when i left corporate i still showed gratitude to corporate because corporate molded me and made me tea cooks with flavor today even though it's not related I, I was never in the food business but be working for corporate instilled certain principles in me that money could never buy so i feel like if someone gifted you with their skill set or gifted you with um the ability to 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 now flourish on your own and things go so on things go left you don't need fear a, a, a wall kind of talk and a bad multi person because now what you're doing is hoping that people can look at me now differently and be like i never know say so tea did stay all right me go come over here and support you me now go support her no more me never know so she did stay when it's all a lie but you're just doing that because you want people to feel sorry for you then and defamate uh, another person's character don't do that don't do that because if you do that and you get one and two clients you're not going to you're not going to your business is just not going to flourish like you're starting it off on the wrong foot 
by bad mouthing another person, especially a person that helped you, it's not the way to go. It's really, really, really not the way to go. And I feel like we need to stop it. And if you're one of those persons and you're watching this channel, and you, you part ways with somebody, no matter talk bad about them, just be better you not say nothing. And just keep it moving. Because remember, you know, lion lips is an abomination unto the Lord. And he sees everything. So even though we don't see it, we might feel like, so, sh oh, she's not here because I say to this person, but well, God see it. And then sometimes when you see people that get beaten in their life, that's why sometimes you must just love them and them get them beaten because you don't know what kind of energy they put out there, why they are in the position that they're in and why they're getting the slashing that they're getting. So sometimes when you see people, I go through it, you must allow it, make them go through it because it, it's, it's almost as if it's deserving. You know, just be careful how you mishandle good people. I always say that I'm not perfect, but I try my best to not mishandle good people. So when I feel mishandled, I feel some type of way. Right? And the new me is just cutting off people. That's just where it's at. I feel mishandled. It's draining my energy. I just don't want no parts of it. And just, that's sad. You know, it's okay to cut off people who drain you you feel like them them drain the energy you feel like them them toxic you feel if, if they don't make you feel good then you don't need to have them around and that's okay it's love you love them from a distance and that's totally okay don't let nobody make you feel like say you have to stay friends or whatever with people who drain you you don't you don't so i never even did plan for go up on a tangent but that's this the conversation go anyways it's about to start raining and we all know watch this first then. we all know that when it rains in Florida nobody remembers how to drive so I'm gonna get off the phone stay tuned for some more videos but we just have a company here just to get that off of my chest and big up on yourself continue to support Rally's festival mix we're out of the five pound um, package, packages but since I'm doing this vlog I got a text from the manufacturer that it's ready for a pickle. Watch your blessing, man. Just watch your blessing, no man. The five pound sold out because I supply a lot of restaurants um, with the five pound, and I also had them on the website. You guys outdid yourself by buying the five pound bags. I mean bottles. So I had to get a re up. So I've been waiting. It's been in production at the factory. So go support the sweet festival, no man. And buy up thing and just what they do. You understand? I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, thank you for your support and everything. Just whether, whether you buy anything from me, yes or no, just your presence being here, giving me a thumbs up, giving me a view, giving me a like. I'm bumping into me on the road. I'm praying for me and just have me on the prayer list and some other prayer warrior that may beg you know. Just keep me on the list, all right? Thank you so much. Um, I will catch you guys in lots more exciting videos that we have coming up tell a friend to tell a friend about this channel if they want some upliftment they want some good vibes and they want some good motivation thanks for watching and i will catch you in my next video bye